Sad day. My Bath and Body Works fragrance. This one was the last um, ra sun riped raspberry that I had, and it ran out. I cannot believe how chilly it is. It's probably in its low 40s right now. Oh, and then let me tell you my bubble bath didn't go too well last night. The water wasn't getting hot. It was just warm and I was really bummed out and I'm like, oh my God, I'm totally wasting this bubble bomb thing. So I took it out and then I just ended up having a shower and then I had to put all the candles away. Bummed out. I don't know what happened. Maybe like the people around the condo took all the hot water. I mean, I really don't know. I'm on my way to Value Village because I finally am going to look for a costume. I didn't even realize that this weekend is Halloween weekend. And I know actually Halloween's on a Monday, right? But whoever celebrates Halloween like after Halloween? So I still don't have plans. I asked my girlfriends what they're doing and they're just kind of like, I don't know. A few years ago, my best friend Salise and I just went to the casino because they have, they always have like events over there. Uh, but this year, I don't know what we're going to do. I mean, it's not like we have to do something. I mean, we're all grown adults now, but it's still fun. Look how neat this is. I don't think I've ever seen a store do this, but they hang it. Oops. They hang it so that you can actually see the brand. And um, I, I don't know, I thought that was pretty interesting. I've never seen that before. So I got my stuff from Value Village and it was like $25 for all this. Um, and then I thought this was cool. There's a costume ideas here. And craft ideas. And in the back it tells you you know what you'll need to create the look so it's good like affordable idea uh, if you don't know what to be for Halloween and you don't want to spend too much money for a full costume it tells you exactly what you need so I'm here at Trader Joe's and just gonna pick up a few things whenever I actually travel to different cities I always look for a Trader Joe's because they've got affordable food They've got some healthy options and just good stuff, man. And you can usually find them in every major city. So this is what I got. I got some grapes. Got some Italian salami. Got a salad for later. Of course, a lot of my blueberries. And then, um, gotta have my tomatoes. Those are the best. I'm at Costco and I just have a sample of coffee, which is this is just the right amount because I don't drink coffee. <laughs> and um, just to let you know, this is the best green tea, in my opinion. It's my favorite green tea. Uh, I don't need to buy it now, but it's only $12.79 and you get 100 packets, individual packets, which I like because when I travel, I'll just throw it in my purse. And after like a large meal, I want to kind of settle my stomach. This is perfect. Got all my errands done. We finally have food in the house so bet you won't be starving when he gets home on Friday um <clears throat> I got some new things I haven't tried before there's this one it's like a beans mix I think it's by organics the same ones the same makers that does the quin quinoa that I like so it's like three different kinds of beans that'd be nice to have and then I tried these salmon burgers they're like salmon patties that a lot of people recommend so I want to try that it was about $13 13 or $14 for a stack of patties and then I bought the thin wheat buns so it's not too much carbs or nice and thin they're only a hundred calories per bun Oops. Hopefully it won't be too hard bringing this up by myself into the condo because I always have Benji help me. But you know what? I need to just stop relying on Benji for everything because I need to learn to be independent even though that's what guys are for. 
just saying. I just filmed a tutorial and just just if you if you watch MTV or if you're a fan of Selena Gomez, uh, do you have any idea what this look is? Um, this is all just for fun because I, I love Selena Gomez and she came out with this promotional video and I thought she was hot and sexy and I could see why it would be a little controversial. Ooh, I totally bit my own. I could see why it would be a little controversial because she's like this Disney star and then she's portraying this badass basically. Um, but I loved her look so I wanted to recreate it. So hopefully you guys like it. It kind of reminds me a little bit of like Lucille Ball because Lu Lucille Ball has a um, really thick eyelashes and she has a red red lips and she has her hair like like this. I think so yeah she has like her curly hair um, but the only thing is that I'm not white and I don't have red hair. I got some of the stuff that I'm wearing at Value Village so the handkerchief 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 was a dollar. The men's shirt was four dollars and um, and I didn't want to show you what I got for Benji because I'm gonna save that till when he actually comes home and I'm gonna have him wear it for you his Halloween costume. I'm here in San Diego, California my old playground as a kid and I'm here with my buddy Gary DeBose. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> And we're just we're just hanging out here on the beach, about to enjoy some real authentic Mexican food. You know how it is in San Diego. So um, yeah, just take a look at that view. Look at that. It's amazing. It's great. But you know what's really funny? Obviously, um, I'm sitting here in this Mexican restaurant, and whoever painted this mural obviously has not never uh, had any experience on water sports. <laughs> No, what I like is it was glued in. <laughs> it's not even in the picture. You've got a surfer in. that's got no surf right next to somebody on a sea dew. Unless he launched that guy off. Yeah, that's what it was. That's what it was. He had a rope <laughs> behind him that he threw away in between the time they took the picture, dropped the rope, this guy spun around, slid out in front of him. He didn't have any weight behind and him at all. A chick on the and back. the woman had to watch it all. And, and this is the kicker. Look how close to the beach there. <laughs> Very dangerous right here. Very dangerous. Okay, so now I'm just watching my favorite show. And I'm going to, for the first time, turn up... Oh! Let me show you actually what I got from Bath & Body Works. All of their fall stuff is 50% off. And I just went in there because I wanted, I needed to refill my um, plug-in. And I got this stuff. I got two of the Apple Crumble uh, candles. And this... I am not really into sweet scents, like if it's like cinnamon or like the sugar cookie. Yeah, I wasn't really that into it, it was more Benji likes, but I seem to like anything apple scent. So the apple crumble is good and it has more of a sweet scent as well, but I don't know, apple, I don't know what it is about apple that I love. These were only like less than five dollars and then I got three of these little stress relief candles and these were on sale for three four five dollars as well oh, it smells so good it kind of smells like a men's cologne I love the smell of men's cologne or it smells like Benji's body wash this one is eucalyptus spearmint oh speaking of Benji Hi, babe. Hey, honey. Um. There's a little stand where there's a bunch of these. And I just needed a refill of this because I'm running out. And then this one's originally $1.50 and it's 75% off. So how much is that? Like 40 cents or something? I really suck at math. And then on top of that, um, the girl was really nice. I didn't have any coupons or anything. But there's these, um, I guess if you go shopping there, or you could just ask for a coupon inside of this. Inside of this, it has 
um, three coupons. And then the, the one up here said if you spent a certain amount of money, I think it was $25, I don't even remember, you get a, a free item. So then the free item up to $13.50. Or $13 so this is what I got it's um, a bubble bath thing and so yeah I got this for free and I got the plug-in too so for all those items let me see I think everything I got was on sale so for two four six for eight items I spent less than $20 1968 and that's including the tax so that was a sweet deal I mean for $20 that's like the cost of two of these and then I got everything else so if you have a Bath and Body Works you need to check it out because it's a really good sale and I get to use these coupons next time that's cute so someone ordered something so I had to make like these but I think I really want to just go more with single and like simple colors instead of making them all. This is neat. I thought they were cute. And there's a uh, uh, lighthouse right in the middle. I don't even want to show them the boat. <laughs>